Hello everyone, Play. I'm here back with another video today. Uh, by the way, I haven't been updating that much, uh, uploading that much because uh, my VIP shut down and public servers are kind of annoying. So I'm using my friend's VIP. He probably doesn't even know about it. So I, I, I uh, yeah. So, anyways, um, oh yeah, today I was gonna show you my M4 Stinger, like I said last time, I think. Uh, this is the spaceship that destroyed everyone. Yeah, you know, I did the super speed. That was pretty cool. Uh, this took a total of four hours. It's not, it's not too long for me. I've done a lot of things that took like, would have taken a day in total, I guess. Uh, so first, we're, uh, you can obviously see all the dynamite aligned on the wings. So with these bits, I used the wheel thing the, the wheel technique and the cake thing these are kind of like vents ventilation uh here is the name hidden uh it says mp1 stinger by side it was m4 stinger because i mean that's, 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 uh, uh, this is the this kind of a symbol i guess it's like a i don't even know these parts i use the wheel technique of, uh these is like a little gap some more ventilation on this side uh, this I used a separate thing for. Yeah, uh, you guys are probably familiar with it. For the boosters on the back, obviously I used the circle thing. Anyways, so we get in this teleporter, and then we are now in the ship. So we have to sit down. This is so to make the ship go turn like go sideways and then thing. You need to have the chair like this. So you press F and you have to click the jet. So if you want your uh, thing to turn like this and like do a bunch of swirls, put your jet seat like that. And um, that's a good thumbnail. Uh, so how I did hyperspeed. So what I did, uh, I made it so if you press F, you go hyperspeed and if you press F, you go back normal. Because when you press F, it activates the thrusters. And when you press F again, it activates the jet. So that's why I have to click the jet and not just press F. Else both of them will activate and it'll be kind of, you know. Uh, I can do some cool tricks and loop to loops. And uh, I can go hyperspeed upwards. Let's go to space. This thing can legit like go to space or something. Let's go! They should add a space update. You know what? No, they should add a boom box update. Everyone wants that. Or like signs. So we are going very fast. Uh, Maybe too fast. Yeah, uh, when the shockwaves are like... Oh, there you go. We're in space. Good job. When you can't see that anymore, that's how you know you're in space. We're going down! Let's try and, uh, get back to the stage. This thing's super cool to play around with. You should make one. Boom! Okay. I want to make a tutorial on, like, a jet fighter or something. That would be really nice. And... And we're back. That's great. Uh, oh yeah, I want to go over a few stages. Uh, let's just fly over some stages. So to control this thing, you need to press uh, left or right, and then you press forward, and it turns like that. So let's go to some new stages and let's do some tricks. Uh, as you can see, here is the book stage. Pumpkin boss, uh, washing machine. That's where you get the, the more teleporters. Uh, this is also not only a cool ship, but this is also a grinding method for y'all that don't know. This is a great grinding method. I'll show you why in a sec. Um, so the thrusters, so I'm just gonna... There you go. Okay. Let's just face the other way. Okay, so how is this a great grinding method, you ask? Well, it's quite simple, my friend. Whoa! Whoa! Only if you know how to use it. But you can, like, go hyperspeed through all these, and it's a great guy, I think. Or you can just, like, kind of... Yeah, you can just... Oh. You, you can just do this. I mean, that works, too. It's kind of like a wheel. Uh, my, uh... Thrusters are broken. Whoa, it looks cool in slow motion. It's like slow motion, guys. Like, 
so I put torches uh, on the end of the wings to add that like wind slicing effect. And I also have uh, torches in a circle formation to do shock waves. Um, and it looks kind of cool when you twist it. So that's, yeah, it's really nice. It's probably one of my favorite, or this is the only spaceship I've ever built. You can do some zigzags. That's pretty nice. And yeah, some zigzags. Looks like I'm lagging. And we can do a mini loop-de-loop. -loop. You know? Okay, so if I want to go back to my base, I can just let it fly. Boop! I'm back to my base. And it's probably gonna die. And I'll show you guys a sneak peek of what I'm working on right now. Uh, where is it? It's Cass... Okay. There. Is that fix it? Yep, yeah, okay. Okay, so this may look like a normal castle, but it's actually a class based PvP game. So uh so I think it's done loading. So this is the lobby. This is just the lobby. So you got go in here. We are now in the character selection room. We only have a lantern snow. S snow snowstorm i think uh these are like kind of mechs or something they have heard their own special abilities and um so what you do is you get in and you can uh you can just kind of fight the other players on the maps this is underground by the way so the maps will also be underground there will be three maps and um, this is Jack o' Lantern, or Lantern as he's known. He's uh, an event character in So Snowstorm, uh, and he has the Magnet ability. So um, this is a pretty cool. Uh, I like it. His Magnet ability can shoot players across or even into the void. That's how you kill people. You kill people by shooting them into the void. So there's gonna be like holes around the map. So that might be pretty OP. Now this is. Uh, snowstorm snowstorm is like a snowman i used a jack-o-lantern for the head and he's like Ugh. his weapon's a candy cane jacks is a scythe and you can just whack people his special ability is uh i'm trying to make it so you can't get the fire potion because you know his special ability is like freeze you can if you have you have to have pvp on you can like freeze other players like and yeah i'm pretty excited to play this game with my friends so i also have a little top hat so that's pretty nice now uh, i want to i want to see something with a uh, jack-o-lantern hold on i want to test his magnet ability obviously it will be less effective with a player controlling uh snow uh, snowstorm but i mean like still i want to test so you can just like grapple players and you can just you can swing them around so let's see and into the darkness and out he comes so uh, i will also have stats like you know stats uh these stats will be like um kind of like these stats are a t damage like how much it knocks of uh, it also has special like the special damage jack lanterns is going to be like top top and it'll also have defense, so how hard it is to knock back. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.